Bhagwani. My name is Harshita. Education is not preparation for life. Education is life itself. Education liberates us from all the shackles of social distinction and is more than simply being books. It is an access to everything that a person is yet to explore. When people talk about deciding their path in life and are also well acquainted with the importance of school education, the principal thought that comes to the mind is that school education should be made free and compulsory for all. A very good morning to the honorable jury members, respected teachers and all the fellow competitors. Today I, Harshita Srinivas, am here to take a stand for the motion on the topic that school education should be made free and compulsory for all children all over the world. Education is a privilege which needs to be granted to all as a birthright. So education completely transforms your inner soul. There have been several instances where children have not been able to chase their dreams. School education being still a dream for many. Yeah, exactly. Um, first of all, let us assume for a moment that education is made free and compulsory. But how will you enforce that compulsion upon the parents? I'll come back to you. So uh, earlier a question had been raised regarding Tanzania that the government is be, uh, punishing the, uh, like the government is punishing the parents themselves for sending the children to school and uh, imposing free education is not uh, giving as such uh, uh, advantage to the people. However, I'd like to come back to you that uh, in Tanzania the government has firstly no right to punish the parents and also uh, when you are talking about free education is bringing some economical imbalance it can also be some other problem there can be some terrorist threat as well because we all know that Tanzania is also affected by terrorist groups so it may not be that only education is bringing them the problem so point of information yeah. um, let me talk about Sachin Tendulkar just imagine if his parents would have forced him to get in some education line like some engineering or something would you have known any legend known as Sachin Tendulkar if his talent would not have been supported? Ma'am, school education today does not mean books. I have been saying this for a very long time. It is about the holistic development of an individual. School education today focuses on co-curricular activities. School education gives you the opportunities. Today it is only because of school education that I get the opportunity to stand here and express my views over the topic. Similarly, it also uh, gives us the right we can go for sports, music, art, dance, whatever we want to because school education provides us the options to take up co-curricular activities. But our education system doesn't support Ma'am, Sorry. Point of information. <laughs> so you said that Tanzania has no right to punish the parents but first of all Tanzania went through with the suggestion of making education free and compulsory upon all but to make sure that this does happen it has to enforce it in some way or the other. In, uh, punishing the parents was the only way to do that and, and second of all the United Nations provides every country with the right to make their own laws and to enforce it in whatever I'll way, come back way to they want. So, um, school is the center for students and teachers. In this temple of learning, the students, forgetting their joys and sorrows, sit together, cherishing and shaping their future dreams. In school, the teachers try to mold the students by sowing some seeds of good qualities in them. Therefore, in order to ensure a greater involvement of the people in the field of education, it should be made free for the masses. People say that in India, we don't have much opportunity for free education. But Sri Sri Ravi Shankar has set up 421 schools in the tribal and the ruler belts of India where child labor and poverty had been widespread. 51,000 children benefit annually from this. Therefore, children who, uh, therefore, saying that opportunities for free education are not available in India has also proved to be wrong. So, Free schooling is itself a mission for the development of a nation. We have seen countries like UK, USA and France which have been providing free education to the children for a very long time and it is only because of education that today they stand before the world having a very high level of per capita income. Therefore, increasing the educational opportunities in our country will increase the literacy rates in India and will enable it to strive as a developed nation. 
The significance of school education is something which needs to be understood by all. School education enables our potential to develop through more than just books and is not a rat raising system. Therefore, I'd just like to come to an end by saying that without education, a child is like a bird without wings. So go on and educate every child because education gives them wings to fly. Thank you so much.